What's good people? Eskimo Cold Beats, Eskimo Cold Beats .com. Today I want to talk about relationship building and uh, it's a very, very important part of marketing your business and that's how you should be thinking of it. It's a business, it's not. Really, if you've making a decision that it's not a hobby anymore, it's a business, then it can't be anything but a business. But it's got to be human still. So when you're relationship building, you don't want to just be selling. Stop, stop just hard selling. Do you know what I mean? You, like I touched on in the other video, it should be out of love, right? So when you're talking to these people, it shouldn't even be, well, it's not even in my mind, right? I'm going to sell to this person today. I'm going to do this. I just think I'm going to build up a relationship with this person, talk back and forth, find out about them. They'll find out about me. And at some point, if our, if my, if my supply, what I supply, meets what they're demanding, then cool. But if not, that's still someone who I can talk to, show my new stuff. I mean, you've got to be thinking in the long term, not just right. That person didn't buy from me; they're no good. It's not a case where people. I mean, we're humans. We're building up these relationships, and it's more than just business and money. It's definitely more than money. Get that in your head. It is more. The money, money doesn't mean shit. They could decide at any point, any time, money's not worth anything anymore. And, we're all, and if you your life has been based around and built around money, then it's over. Or at least you've got to start again. So what you need to really be doing is, you know, not just posting links at people. Do you know what I mean? Like the people I talk to, I'll ask them how their day's been. Do you know I mean, what have they been doing? If, I, if I've if i sold them a beat, I'll ask them, oh, how are you getting on with that beat? Do you need anything? Can I help you out? And I'm not trying to sell them. These are things I'm just offering if they need me to share it there or if they need me to do this and that and it's not going to cost me anything, then I've got no problem in doing it because at the end of the day, I'm not doing it to earn favours, but I'm more likely to get favours from people I've done favours for. And that's part of building relationships. It's a... It's just seeing each other on a level. You're, you're not supposed to think, right, I'm I'm this person that makes this much business and this much money and they're just uh, treating it like a hobby. And uh, You, you can't see people like that because pe your energy, it's all about your energy. People are going to feel that energy. People know when you're trying to sell to them. Do you know what I mean? Same way they can tell, like, oh, right, he's just trying to help me out. Okay, he's going to get a sale for it, but he's just trying to help me out, which is what I'm trying to do. Which is why um, what I do is people that fuck with me, people that will talk to me on a regular basis and it does. we never talk about sales. I never ask anyone I talk to on a regular basis. I don't know these people in real life, but I'm not on there to be like, oh, I got this, I got this. Like, I'll throw them free stuff. Like, If, you, if you're one of my customers, I'll throw you a free beat every now and again. I mean, I've just given everyone I talk to, whether they're customers or not, well, if they're customers, I've, I've given them a coupon and... Um, 25% if they're customers it's 25% forever so I mean I haven't put a time limit on it if we they haven't bought anything then I've given them three uses 25% on three uses so I mean that's that's value that's value I'm, I'm not seeing many other producers doing stuff like that they're just so focused on the money that they they're not even realizing that it's so visible they're transparent you can just see through someone who's trying to sell you something. Stop selling and just supply. Just supply to people. There's a demand for everything in this world. Like, let me think of an example, right? If you walk out that door, every single thing you see has got money in it somewhere down the line. Grass. People cut the grass. I mean, people sell the seeds for grass. People plant stuff in grass. There's money in grass. Lamp posts. Someone had to build the metal. Someone had to buy the metal. The electrics. They had to get an electrician. But everything is worth money. So you need to work out from your strong points how you're going to make money. But don't make money the be all and end all. Just, just do it. Mean it. Love it. And it'll just happen. It'll just... I, I, I make it sound like it's magic, because it's not magic. It's a lot of, not hard work, it's smart work. And you've got to keep at it and keep doing it. But once you get your formula, and you just keep running with it, you know, 
talk to people, get them to talk back, talk about them, speak to them, find out about them, just out of intrigue, just, it's nice to know more, knowledge, get knowledge, if you just stick with yourself, you're never going to learn anything, I mean, if you're just selling to people, you're never going to get any back and forth off people, you're not going to find out where your weaknesses are, a friend will tell you your weaknesses, a, a, a good friend will tell you your weaknesses and where you can improve on them, so if you're building up a relationship with these people, then hopefully you'll get to the point where they're helping you without putting money in your pocket, and that's the idea. Do you know what I mean? That Just provide value. Show people that you've got value to give, and they'll give you what value they've got, whether that be in money form or helping you out the same way, or however they can help you out. It's just, there's a lot more in this thing mentally than physically. It's not what you just see. Okay, it's, it's what you think. I wake up every morning now and I listen to positive audio and my day just, it just flies. Flies, but productively. And I just smile for no reason. I just sit there and smile. And I, I think I haven't, got, I haven't got a reason, but then when I really think, I've got no reason not to smile because I'm chasing the dream and I'm getting closer every time. And it's from all these things that I'm talking about. It's just being completely open and knowing what you want. And it's more than what you want, it's why you want it. Why do you want it? So my laptop crashed halfway through that one, so I have to cut another clip in. But where was I? Um, why? Why do you want it? Do you want the house? Do you want the car? Do you want the lifestyle? Well, why do you want it? Do you want to build an empire? That's what I want to do. I want to build a legacy, something that lasts past me. I, w I want to do it so that whatever comes after me doesn't have to worry, doesn't have to do all this. Unless they want to, I hope they want to. And I hope they know why they want to. But it's just, just think about, just think about everything. Think about what you're doing. Think about what, you, think about what you've done that's worked. Think about why you, if you know something doesn't work, don't, if you're not seeing any progress, change it. You can change it. Find, find out what you need to do. You know, but I'm gonna wrap it up around here. Uh, save some topics for other videos. Probably hit, I'm gonna try and hit you all up with a video daily, maybe twice, three times, just whenever I get the time. But yeah, relationship building was the main focus. So just show respect, give respect. Don't do it for money. Just get to know people, and if your the your supply meets their demand, if it's meant to be, it'll, it'll happen. They'll just happen. Stop stressing. Stop working hard, and work smart. Right? It's Eskimo Cold, Eskimo Cold Beats dot com, Beat Selling Squad, all of that. Peace.